Sonia. I'm from a small seaside town called Deal in the southeast of England. And somehow I ended up here at the University of Illinois. And computers have been a really important part of that journey. So I'm going to share some of my stories with you now. When I was at school, writing really was about correctness and um, I didn't find spelling easy and I didn't find it easy to find my mistakes. I remember sitting on the school bus and my friend, my best friend Kate would um, take out her homework and I'd take out my homework and she'd, she'd take one look at my homework and she'd find a mistake practically in the first sentence even though I'd looked over it again and again, painstakingly. So computers were, and still are, incredibly helpful with my writing. Um, they've really sort of taken the pressure off. And um, now, I, because I write so much more, my spelling's improved. Um, and yeah, they've just been this wonderful, amazing tool for me. Listen. I tell many people that I was one of the first girls in my high school to take computer technology, which was a new subject at the school. Um, what I don't tell many people is that I actually dropped out of that class. Um, I was the only girl in the class, as I said. And um, the teacher was very difficult. Um, I remember one time him playing a trick on me that made me look like I'd broken the computer and he had all the boys laughing about that. Um, and I'm not sure if he actually, you know, was being sexist, but I felt very uncomfortable in the class. I dropped the class and I went on... Um, to take the typing class where all the girls were typing with manual typewriters and in some ways you know that's kind of a sad story but it's got a funny side to it too because when I think about typing I use typing all the time my keyboarding skills are really really important to me um, and really what I learned in the in the computer class and what I could have learned in the computer class is is now completely out of date. My family went crazy for technology and um, my dad in particular loves gadgets. I've just come back from England and um, I had to take him an, a new iPad so he could be one of the first people in England to get an iPad. Um, and my parents' house is still completely uh, taken over by gadgets everywhere. There's monitors on the kitchen table. Uh, drives my mother a little crazy. Uh, my brother went to school and he took computer science. And um, I like technology, but it wasn't my thing. And so I went to college and eventually became a teacher. Leaving on a jet plane Don't know when I'll be back again um, So after teaching in England for about four years, I decided to teach in Hungary and um, got on a plane. I'd never been to the country before. I was incredibly nervous and ended up having this amazing experience. I um, I missed home at first, but um, one of the things that really helped me to be stay connected with my family was computers and email in particular. Um, and and um, so I, I feel really, really grateful to email. And now, uh, more so to Facebook, because I have friends all over the world and I use Facebook all the time to keep in contact with people. It's a really important part of my life, a really important way of staying connected with people. Was 
Nigerian Hungary. Uh, I, I went to the summer university there, to Debrecen University. Um, this is a bit of a love story. And I met a wonderful American there who I had this fabulous summer romance with. And I think that's where it would have ended if it hadn't been for computers and email. And we, after he went back to, to Hungary, uh, to, to the United States, after the summer, uh, we emailed and we emailed every day, often more than once a day, and um, got to know each other more. And then he visited me and I visited him, and he's now my husband, and I've been living here for eight years. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm extremely grateful to computers for for that, for him. Technology is now incredibly important for my daughter. Um, we've had a difficult start in life and uh, has, I mean, she's doing fabulously well. She's a wonderful character. Um, she's four years old now and um, she has now been walking um, for almost a year. Um, she still has um, the motor difficulties which uh, affect her ability to, to draw and, and as she's working, you know, we're thinking towards writing, that's going to be difficult. Um, so we're working to quickly get her onto keyboarding so she doesn't struggle with handwriting for years and years. Um, and using the mouse and those those kinds of things, and then she also, um, because of her motor difficulties, uh, had trouble with speech. Um, so she will soon uh, be getting a, a Vantage Two, um, which is an augmentative communication device, which will help her speak. So, yes, I I had no idea how important technology was going to be in my life. Out came the sun Here comes the sun do, 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 do. Here comes the sun I say It's alright